New tonight, a major problem in Michigan, food insecurity. A recent U.S. Agriculture Department study shows one in five Michigan kids, 20%, live in food insecure home. The overall numbers for this state are also concerning. The USDA survey indicates nearly 13% of people in Michigan were food insecure over a two-year period. The group Hunger Free America says more needs to be done to address this. There really is a hunger crisis. People are hungry right now in our community and across the state. 1.2 million Michiganders lived in a household that was food insecure from 2020 to 2022. People in the state of Michigan can't always afford enough food. The USDA defines food insecurity as the limited or uncertain availability of adequate and safe foods. Between 2021 and 2023, there was a 67% spike in the number of Michiganders who didn't have enough food over just one week period. Joel Berg is Hunger Free America's CEO. He attributes the current hunger problems across the country to pandemic relief ending. More money was given to communities to address hunger. People were receiving more SNAP benefits and all that went away. Berg says food banks can only do so much to address the issue. Food charity is a vital way to fill in a few of the gaps in the safety net. But we need to be honest with ourselves, that's not a serious response to hunger. 1.2 million people in the state systematically don't have enough food. The only way we're going to change that is by raising wages and ensuring there's an adequate safety net. It's not just adults going hungry. Kids also face food insecurity. In Michigan, Governor Gretchen Whitmer signed into law free breakfast and lunch for all K-12 public school students. Berg says that's a start, but more needs to be done. So this really needs to be a wake-up call that our federal, state, and local officials, our business leaders have to get serious about finally ending this problem. Berg hopes to see benefits that were added during the pandemic brought back and made permanent. He also believes that raising wages will help ease the hunger crisis.